Hello and welcome to a Connect product demonstration. Today we're going to talk about the Plumet jetting machines. What we have here is the Ultimaz family, the E25 model and the P2P. The P2P is uh, operated with a hand drill. The E25 works on a battery. Basically when you want to jet cables, if you have short distances you can do it with the machine only. If you have to go longer distances you want to use air. Uh, to uh, put the cable in suspension within the conduit and uh, limit the friction. So when you want to get ready to do your job, uh, what you need is microduct to go into your system. We're using some dies. If you are going to um, use air to put the cable in suspension, you would put a gasket around here to make sure the air is going in the microduct and not outside. You install the die like this. And then we have a locking wheel that comes around here, secures everything in place. Like this. And then you would insert it on this side put the lock and pin in and we're good to go on this side if you're gonna use air we have this accessory comes in here goes to your compressor on the other side so again for long distances along with uh, the air that is gonna limit the friction by putting the cable in suspension you may want to use some jetting lube just a few drops of this if you look on the side of the uh, the bottle it will tell you depending on the distance and the size of your microduct how much you should be using put a few drops put your microduct with your cable dies inside the machine and then you can start jetting on the other side of the machine we need some cable guides depending on the overall diameter of your cable there are different sizes. So choose the one according to the size of your cable. Same principle, you put the two of them together, push it in, push it in, install the lock and pin, and we're good to go. Then you can insert your cable, make sure it's going inside the microduct. So once all the parts are assembled, all you have to do is turn the knob to engage the wheels and it'll start pushing the fiber in and soon we'll see it appear on the other side of the conduit. There we go. 